ISIS League team Enfield battled hard, but second division Peterborough never really lost their grip on this game. Scott Houghton opened the scoring after 20 minutes, the Enfield keeper Andy Pape rightly annoyed. Then just a minute later, the same player put over a perfect cross and Ken Charlery doubled the lead with his fourth FA Cup goal this season. Enfield didn't lie down and showed their fighting spirit with Martin St. Hilaire giving them a glimmer of hope on the half hour. But it was Martin Carruthers, signed from Stoke last month, who sealed it. He put Peterborough two goals in front again before half time. No Enfield had managed to hold Peterborough to a one all draw ten days ago. Eight minutes into the second half, they were finally put out of their misery, with Carruthers running onto Charlery's pass. Barry Fry's men now take the long trip to Plymouth for the third round. Scunthorpe twice threw away the lead at home to Wrexham. With both teams fighting for the privilege of West Ham in round three, it was the third division's leading scorer, Paul Baker, who gave the home side the lead after just seven minutes. That's how it stayed until 20 minutes from time when Brian Hughes scrambled a corner into the net to level it up for the Welsh side. But Phil Clarkson put Scunthorpe back in front two minutes later and seemingly into the next round. But again, they couldn't hold on for the win and three minutes from the end, Steve Morris took advantage of Mark Samway's wild swing at the ball to send the tie into extra time. Samway's had to hold his hands up again with 115 minutes on the watch. He brought down Morris and Steve Watkin put the second division team into the third round. Liverpool are still waiting to find out who their third round opponents will be. The electrics played a bigger part than the football at Turf Moor, where Burnley were a goal down to the inaptly named Carl Lightbourne after just eight minutes. But at half-time, the lights went out and didn't come back on again for the second half. Match abandoned and rescheduled for next Monday. Well, Wickham Wanderers are now preparing for a home tie with Bradford in round three as a reward for their win over Barnet live on Sky. But they had a couple of scares along the way. Here's Martin Tyler with the goals. Campbell and Hodges in the centre for Barnet. Tomlinson going further. And it's scored, Jamie Campbell. Let me remind you again, we have to have a result, even if it goes to penalties. It's 1-1, and John Williams. McGavin getting across in front of Howarth. That's Carroll. Oh, and the goalkeeper has made a hash of it. This is D'Souza. He's still going. Mikel D'Souza. Hodges. Still, 